Here's a new report on Gray Street Grape and Gracie's Grape. As you can see, the grapes on Gray Street, which I'm now feeling almost uh, for sure is the a variety called Daytona. If they're red, they're Daytona. Uh, they definitely have seeds. They're not seedless like Red Plain. And you can see wherever I point the camera and move foliage, I've got a tremendous number of grapes setting. Uh, a friend was visiting last week and she commented uh, how much larger the fruit are uh, compared to her wild species type, which I think might be uh, Vitus estivalis. Let's take a peek in here. Now this is a Gray Street grape, which occupies the south end of the hen house, and it gives them shade in the summertime. But over here, on the west side, is Gracie's grape, which makes I feel denser clusters. You can see all over in here, very large numbers of grapes. A Gracie's grape makes a wonderful purple, a classic Concord tasting grape. Look at this nice cluster here. We'll look at this one. Oop, get that leaf out of the way. And we go, get my hand in there for scale. I've long felt that Gray Street, uh, Gracie's grape, I'm sorry, was the variety uh, Blue Lake. I got it many years ago from my now deceased friend Gracie Valdez, who was the mom of my longtime high school friend Mike Valdez. She'd gotten the original plant from a neighbor. I failed for years to root cuttings, and I finally got this one to take a couple years ago. And last year it absolutely took off, and I'm going to be looking at a very large harvest this year. Go back on for one more view of Gray Street Grape, which I'm really excited about because it's been growing for four years. Last year it made just one grape after making thousands of blooms at the wrong time of year. Uh, that one grape was red, and at the time I did not know about either um, Red Flame or Daytona. So that's it. I probably won't bother to shoot another one of these until we, I see some color in the fruit, but at this point I'm expecting them to be red. Uh, I've eaten quite a few already and they all have seeds and that's pretty much a dead giveaway that this is the variety Daytona. Talk to y'all later. Bye.